Well, welcome back to the art table. This painting right here is a copy of one that Georgia O'Keeffe painted. It's called the Black Mesa, and it's got some awesome colors in it. It shows the landscape right outside the door there at Ghost Ranch, and you see how she used her lines and her shapes to make all these little gullies and ditches in the mountains and in the hills. So I thought we would continue to use our pastels to do this. But unlike the last time where I used my fingers to blend in the pastels, I've got something else that I think you might like and might want to try to blend it in. And that is, I've got just a wooden stick. You could use a toothpick or any type of little stick that you can find. And I've cut up little bits of paper towel. And you can wrap the paper towel around your stick and use it to blend in case you don't want to use your fingers. Some people don't want to get their fingers messy. So we're going to use this in just a little bit to blend in our colors. But um, I also have a piece of blue, light blue paper. This is pastel paper. Pastel paper has little tiny um, indentations. It's called the tooth of the paper that helps to catch all of the pastel really nicely. But if you don't have pastel paper, that's fine. You can use a piece of construction paper or even if you just want to use a piece of white paper and you can color the sky blue up here. But I'm going to allow my paper to be part of my blue sky for me. So that's one less thing that I have to do. So we're going to start with this and I think I am going to start up at the top these mountains in the very far back and it even looks like there might be a little snow on that mountain which is very cool. So I think I'm going to go ahead and put a little snow up there but I'm going to draw this mountain range first and I think that this color right here might be a great color for that mountain range. So I'm going to go ahead and get it drawn in as it comes down over like that and I'll add the snow in here in just a just a little bit so we're gonna go ahead and color in this mountain range seeing that black mountain range and right there so I'm going to kind of trace that where that's going to be in color just above it now like I said you can use your finger to blend this or oh I like that little hump right there let me get that little hump in there is that little hump right there use your finger or you can use a piece of paper towel or tissue. Let's see how this is going to work. So I'm going to wrap it around here. I'm going to blow it. There we go. I need to put my snow in. Now we get to these really dark, dark hills. So I'm going to get a darker blue. I'm going to put this blue back. I'm going to try to go with this one. Let's see how this does. I see this mountain range.
black shadows in here, so I'm going to come back and add that. a little bit of light right in here. 